So guys, tonight I am gonna do these foil packet burgers. I've been having trouble just doing burgers on my stove or on my little griddle and so I thought you know what I can do burgers in a foil packet and all the mess is contained and then everyone gets their own little burger in a packet and it would just be something fun something different so I've got five pounds of ground beef here that I just defrosted in my microwave I've got a whole bunch of green onions now spice wise I don't have much to work with I have to get back to the store I'm out of all my staples but I do have a little bit I have some ground oregano and I have some Italian seasoning and and then salt and pepper, those are gonna be our spices. I'm gonna wrap them all up individually in an aluminum foil and cook them for about an hour on 400 in the oven. And it'll just it'll just be fun, be something different. We always like different things, right? These would also be really good if you wanted to, you know, stuff cheese. Oh, that reminds me, I have cheese, I can do that. You could stuff cheese on top of the burgers, you could do mushrooms, you could do, you know, big round onions. There's a lot of fun things you could do and add to your burger packet. So I put about half of the green onions that I had in our bowl that we're gonna mix up with our burgers. And now it's just the good old fashioned job of mom's hand mixing the hamburger patty meat. I put about a tablespoon of Italian seasoning, tablespoon of that oregano and salt and pepper. I'm gonna mix it up. So here we have basically a baker's dozen of large hamburger patties. We've got 13 big Stewart size patties. And we're gonna also have this with a lettuce, tomato, and cucumber salad. I'm gonna actually eat mine on a salad. So I'm gonna get them in their little foil packets now. So you saw how I did that. I just laid the burger down in a square of foil and then I pinch it nice and tight and then I'm just putting them on a baking sheet. packets on this tray and I have eight up here and if you just saw in the video I did three of them with a whole bunch of onion on top I thought my husband might like that I don't know they don't necessarily eat three tonight plus a salad but um, but that's how many I'm doing for them so like it or leave it right and uh, put them in the oven now so I'm gonna do for an hour at 400 talk about an oven that needs a clean and my oven needs a cleaning but there they are and I'm gonna set our timer for one hour there we go. So I just pulled the first tray of our burgers out and I did check one about five minutes ago, but I'll open one up for you guys. And these are just so clean and convenient. Actually, I made to put my camera down for a minute. Okay, so here's what the nice little perfect burger looks like in its foil packet. And for the kids, I am actually gonna take their burgers out, and put them on their plate with their salads. So I just took this tray of burgers out. This is just the trash I'm gonna throw away. I sprinkled some shredded cheese on top. I did put them in the microwave for 20 seconds just to melt the cheese. And they look beautiful. Jaden's chopping some salad for us now and I'll show you our plates. And then also real quick when I open the packet, this is what my husband's burgers turned out like with the onions on top. So I did this big salad for us, or actually, excuse me, Jaden and Zion chopped it, and then Jaden also did tomatoes. Not everyone likes tomatoes, but they can just add what they want to. So here's a quick look at what Naomi's plate looks like. We're just eating around the counter tonight. If you want the recipe on how to do the easy burger foil packets, makes it quick cleanup, just go over to largefamilytable.com, and I'll have that all written out for you. I'll see you next time, friends, with another brand new video.